What's up YouTube, it's Sufan from TechCycle. In this video, I'm going to share you guys an application called ULT Data, which can be used to recover deleted files like WhatsApp message, photos, contacts, videos, or any other files from your iDevice or from your iTunes backup or from iCloud's backup. So let's start this journey. Before we start this journey, I would like to thank Tanner share for sponsoring this video so let's start this journey so head out to the link in the description that is the Tanner share link and my sponsor link so use that link to download this ULT data by the way if you are here to record that deleted whatsapp message I prefer you guys to stop watching this video because you are not going to find anything useful because you can't recover deleted whatsapp message from your iDevice directly by using this ULT data you can only recover whatsapp message from an iTunes backup or from iCloud's backup you can directly recover from an iDevice so for recovering the deleted whatsapp message your better shot is make a backup frequently or you can follow the guide over there you can find something useful over there so back to this tutorial so head out to the link in the description and download this ULT data. This ULT data cost about $59.95. I prefer you use the trial version for right now and after watching this video completely if you, if you prefer to buy this, buy that or not. The choice is yours. On the trial version the functionality of this app is pretty much limited because you can only see the part of the data you can't even see the full data you can only see the part of the deleted data which can be recovered so it is limited so watch this video completely if you prefer to buy that buy it or not i will give you guys verdict of the of this ult data at the end of this video so back to recovery so head out to the link download the version install this all this is pretty simple so open up this application on the application there will be three options recover from iDevice recover from iTunes backup or recover from iCloud choose the source you want to recover the files from for this tutorial I'm going to choose iDevice after choosing the device choose start scan and it's going to scan the device on my test device which is an iPhone 5 or 16 gigs it took about 10 minutes for a complete scan and on the subsequent and on subsequent scan it took about 7 minutes so on the subsequent scan, subsequent scan of the device it is going to take lesser time so it's a good thing to know so after the scan is completed on the result page on the left side of the page you can find all the section from which the file is recovered and on the right side you can view the files that is recovered from that particular section on the result page you can filter the deleted files and existing files by using the drop down menu located at the top of this ULT data application so use that for filtering this ULT data to get a perfect accurate result so choose the file you need to recover on my test of this I choose a file which you need to be recovered and I press the recover option and it's going to show you guys a dialog box to choose the recovery destination on my test I choose the desktop new folder 7 and I recovered the file completely and on the destination folder of this recovered file I found another folder called the Tanoshare ULT data and inside that folder I found a folder with a, my device serial number as the folder name and inside that folder I found out a folder with the date and time as its name which is the date and time I recovered the file and on that folder I find the category from which the file I recovered and inside that folder only I found out the recovered file so it is a pretty much well organized recovery now for the effectiveness of this software on my test this ULT data record all the files completely and safely without any problem so it is working perfectly so thumbs up for that but a problem that I faced while using this ULT data is that the files that are shown as deleted files on this ULT data is not deleted files it is already existing files it is showing the deleted files also but it is also showing the existing files as deleted files so the convenience of using this application is not that good but it is working perfectly and if you need to recover a one file one file that you need to recover you can pinpoint that file very easily and efficiently on this ULT data 
You can use this ULD data to require files from your iOS device or even from an iOS device running on iOS version 12. You can use this ULT data to require the files. You can't really use this ULT data to require WhatsApp message, but still you can use this ULT data to backup these WhatsApp messages into an XML file, XLS file, HTML file or test file. You can use this to backup your WhatsApp message into any of this format. It is a simple backup option for these type of files that is going to be listed here. Now for the verdict, this ULT data costs about $59.95 for a lifetime license. I can only recommend this ULT data for people who lost photos, contacts, videos or any of the files from this list and don't have any iCloud backup or iTunes backup and want that deleted file very much. Your option is to get this ULT data because you are not going to regret any of the choice you made because it is working perfectly. But I can't recommend this software to people who need to require a WhatsApp message or who need to require file that is deleted but have an iTunes backup or iCloud backup because you can get an alternative backup extractor that is iTunes backup extractor or iCloud backup extractor which is going to cost you less than this $59.95 and can work like this ULT data or like in that same level you can get any other software like that with a lesser price point so I given what I can about all these recovery software and I have given my choice for you guys now decision, this now decision is upon you so that's all about this video guys thanks for watching talk to you in next one and don't forget to subscribe